Hello and welcome back to the channel. Welcome to a bit more reacting to Love Island UK Winter Edition. Uh, end of last episode, lots of drama, and we're sending two Australians in for some reason. God, let's just jump right into it. Obviously, me and Ron have been happy, and now you two are going to be coupled up. You must be feeling it in a sort of way to have picked him. Yes, and neither. Anything that would hurt me now, things are going on behind my back. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, fair enough, Lana's a bit upset there. <laughs> Trying to keep the peace with Tanyelle, because obviously they're mates, but yeah, not too happy with uh, Tanyelle picking her bloke, which, yeah, big fair enough. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. I, I know Tanyelle made the decision on that. I still don't trust Ron. I still don't trust Ron fully, honestly. I know he has the fake eye. I also think he has a wandering eye a little bit. There's just one comment that got me. This boy has made his feelings very clear. What does that mean? She's playing a very different game. Ron just clearly doesn't like Zara. Ron just very clearly doesn't like Zara for whatever reason. You can make your own decisions on that one. I won't say anything. Um, he just clearly doesn't. And like, yeah, Tom is saying one thing to Zara. To Zara, he has made his things very clear that she is his number one priority. It's just the fact that he's he's too nice to tell Olivia to go away and he's not interested. Like, Jesus. That's what that comment's about, all right? No need to bloody sigh at Aya over here. I think like, I'm just genuinely really excited to get to know you. Like, mm -hmm. Just keep doing what we're doing. Aww. You know, I know everyone's got their differing opinions. I think Zara and Tom are cute. I do. Um, I think that Tom needs to just shut Olivia down, because I do think he's just not interested, and, you know, being too nice or whatever, but I just don't think he's interested in Olivia. I don't think he is more into Zara, and I think they are working well together, and I think they'll work a lot better together if Tom will just, for the love of God, shut off Olivia, <laughs> and shut down whatever arguments are going on between everyone about this. I feel like, if I'm completely honest, you've come in and kind of come for me a bit. Comment made about the two-faced going for, like, the guy that I'm coupled up with. Oh, oh I'm so done with this. I don't know what beef these two have, okay? Because all the stuff online that, you know, they follow each other on Instagram, they were in a music video together, they already knew each other. I don't know what beef's got on between them. <laughs> but Tom isn't that deep, so it's got to be something. God. Yeah. Olivia thought Zara was coming for her a bit with everything. Zara just vibed with Tom the most. And I think she did the two-faced thing to Olivia because having known her on the outside thought she would, you know, find it more, you know, be too more chill about it or whatever. They, they, whatever the beef is, I'd like to know what it is. <laughs> and I'd like him to squash it for the love of God. <laughs> you said to her that you're leaning way towards her. I didn't say way I, more I, towards Well, that's what she said. When Zara come in, I have probably a bit of an instant connection. I just feel mugged off. Why? Oh my god. The issue here is Tom. The issue here is Tom... Yeah, I do think him and Zara just had a better connection than him and Olivia. But he didn't tell Olivia. And he didn't shut it off with Olivia. Okay? <laughs> Olivia, you're a great girl. But I think it's more friend vibes. I'd say more with Zara. And we'd be sorted. We wouldn't be still talking about this. You two cackling all night was doing my fucking nothing. Oh, last night was not even flirty. Yeah. Oh, oh, speaking see? of the guy. We're just literally just walking, even as friends. <laughs> I mean, first of all, Lana, yeah, they were... They, Ron ain't that funny, Tanya, okay? Ron ain't that funny if you be laughing like that all night. <laughs> but also... I love Tanya about to gas things up a little bit, just a little bit. You know, that wasn't even like flirty. That was just like, oh my god. And then Ron of his to bring a coffee just to Lana and not to her. So Jimmy just cuts off saying, Yeah, but we're just just friends wise, I think. Like, <laughs> shut it down. Oh, like magic Ron appears to shut everything down. <laughs> really just naturally just clicked. He kissed me on the terrace. Did he? First, oh. yeah. And I think he just wanted think... to not hurt anyone's feelings. Yeah. But I said to him, you're going to end up hurting someone. <sighs> These morning chats are so awkward. <laughs> so I was just there talking about, yeah, me and Tom were snogging on the terrace. Olivia's right next to her like, oh, really? That happened, did you? Oh, like, <laughs> so awkward. <laughs> oh, it's all so awkward. 
<laughs> Tom, please. There's a couple of Aussies on their way. I just don't like the twist. Okay, I like twists. I do. And it's an interesting twist. There's a new one. Fair. Fresh, whatever. But, you know, yeah. Uh, Love Island, you know, if we're going to continue telling ideas of shows just about finding love or whatever instead of fame, then throwing people in who are trying to make a long-term connection thousands of miles away ain't helping. It just isn't helping. I'm like a kid in a candy store and all these beautiful girls in the villa is just battling that temptation and to be honest with you she's quite tempting i don't like ron i really don't you know constantly to lana he's like you're my only option you know not my only option you're the only person i'm interested in you know all that really happy and then every second i'm listening to this man off camera saying oh this girl's tempting oh if lana weren't here though like Oh, God. If Lana wasn't here, isn't exactly the, the running ringing endorsement of... <laughs> you think it is. To your um, not-wandering-eye status, Ron. Like, Jesus Christ. I feel like if Lana was out the villa, I'd proper like to stick it on Tanya. I mean, and now adding fucking her to the mix as well, this fucking Jesse. <clears throat> Ron, Ron, Ron. Jesus. Lana, no. Oh, God. Lana, I like Lana. Lana's sweet, I think. I don't like Ron. I really don't. I see a lot of people liking Ron. I don't get it. He just seems like a player. He seems like a dickhead. I don't like him. I don't. He just, when Casa Amor comes and he can't physically see Lana, I think he's got a dinosaur effect. If he, you know, can't see movement, she's not here. <laughs> and he's going to be having some fun over there. And I, I, don't, I don't vibe with him. She seems lovely. I feel like genuinely you could be a vibe together. And I could wing woman that. It's role play. Now I'm Jesse. What are you going to say? Hey, babe. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out wing woman Lana here. <laughs> oh, I like her and Will. They're just good friends. They're, they just have banter. They have a laugh. <laughs> Lana, please never try the Australian accent again. <laughs> please. Screw up kind of like in the country. Loving it, oh, say, yes. honestly. <laughs> Do you like it there or? Love it, yeah, because everyone in here is like city, city people and I'm like a little country boy. <laughs> Unbelievable. They're cute. Okay, sue me, they're cute, okay. <laughs> Maybe I'll just take anything for Will because I just really like him and I want him to be happy. But him and Olivia seem to be vibing. They seem to be cute. They seem to be matching a little bit. She's a country girl as well, like the vibe's there. Okay, let's build it. Let's build this vibe, baby. You know, we were just chatting away and it was really, really nice. I kind of like forgot everyone. Kind of like throughout my whole life, I don't think I've ever had that. Aww. Will sounded close to tears. Oh, I'm happy. They do seem to be vibing at the minute. Okay, it's only like a first chat. You can't fully go off it. But the vibe seems to be there. And she seems nice. And I'm liking it. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Come on, I'm not even gonna try and ship name this. What we got? What's her name? Jesse. West Wissy. Gel. Gel. They seem to be gelling. There you go. Gel. They seem to be gelling. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> Never have I ever slept with someone that I've worked with. That would be my dad, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for, uh, thanks for being specific there, Will. <laughs> I guess he was right. He works on the farm with his dad, so has he shagged his dad? No. Thanks for, thanks for confirming you haven't shagged your dad, Will. <laughs> Never have I ever thought that someone in this vibe thing yeah. no. was playing a game and not really looking for love. Daniel just wants drama, man. We're just trying to vibe and have a good time. And Tanya, I was just this time trying to never ever before someone was a two faced like bitch, huh? Oh, huh? isn't that fun? Like, Jesus Christ. I like drama too, Tanya, but God. One of them. What? The actor. Who was that? Um, it's my ex boyfriend. Yeah. Who? He's called Owen Warner. Fuck. Jesus, part of my language. Sorry. I'm sorry. I was standing there. Lana's ex is Owen Warner. Jeez. Ron's got some competition. Look up Owen Warner if you haven't. Um, from I'm a Celeb. I knew him before that from Hollyoaks. He's great. He's funny. He's 
and he's he's just he's really hot. Yeah, <laughs> Ron. <laughs> You go okay, you go and bloody live up to what I mean. Good luck, mate. What was that? Huh? What, what was that? What do you mean? I just wonder what the conversation was about, the context. Oh, it's um private. Oh god. I could Jesus Christ, they're still going. I can kinda of see this from both sides, okay. Um Zara should speak to Tom about it, obviously. Um But then Olivia I feel is is trying to get to Zara there, you know, walking up, making a big show, big dramatic wave off to Tom, big smile on her face, Ooh, you know, phew, you know, like Olivia is trying to rub that in Zara's face a little bit. Zara should talk to Tom about it, yeah, um, but Olivia shouldn't. I feel like Olivia's trying to do some drama here. <laughs> Olivia clearly just doesn't like Zara. Let's just get that out there. Zara doesn't like. What is the drama here? What is the drama between them two? Just agree to disagree, I yeah, think. Yeah, no, that's what I was thinking. I think where I'm at, though, my focus is on Harris now. I, I heard it is genuinely huh? good. Oh, uh, God. Glad you talked it through. Glad you finally agreed, you know, to agree to disagree. That's the only way you two are going to get this bloody mess sorted, which, fine. Um, Olivia, you, what? You're focused fully on Harris now. That's not what you said to Tom last night. All, all this acting over Tom. <laughs> he might be a better actor than I thought, to be fair, Olivia. <laughs> all this over Tom. You mean, like, well, it doesn't even matter, because I'm into Harris. Oh, you're not. You're not, Olivia. Don't joke around with me. I got a text! Oi! Aaron, it's time for you to go on your first date. Please choose two girls. I got a text! Right, so Jesse and Aaron get to go on some dates now. They get to pick people. Who are they going to pick? Aaron? I don't know. Honestly, um, Jesse, Will, and someone. I don't know. I, I, of the four people, <laughs> I can only be sure of Will, which is great to me at least. Olivia and Lana. Date would be Will and Tom. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Just Harris's reaction. What she was going to pick, he was like, he wanted and thought it was going to be him. <laughs> It wasn't. Oh, Harris. Will and Tom. All right. Fair. Uh, Jesse, you don't want that beef with Zara, though. <laughs> and Aaron picks uh, Olivia and Lana, which, yeah, Olivia's the single girl around here. Uh, and Lana, yeah, I would like her to have some more options other than Ron, so I fully support all of these options chosen. <laughs> Your strawberry then. Oh. oh no. Oh, what's, he doing? what's he doing? There you go. I'm like a giraffe. <laughs> oh, the guy that you look. oh, Will and Jesse are cute. I like them together, I do. Okay, I'm enjoying the vibe. Let me vibe with it for the love of God. They're cute. Um, and shout out Lana and Tom. <laughs> Looking like bloody Will's parents cheering him on from afar, <laughs> getting worried at some parts. <laughs> I love it. I love it all. Thank you so much for coming on the date with me. I, th I think I should be the one thanking you. No. I no. Honestly, it's an honour. Um, and I would like to go on a second date if that's kind of on the cards. Oh, oh God. <laughs> I'm way too invested in these two already. And they're not even in a proper couple. I'm, this is, like, why do I feel like it's going to break my heart at some point? Oh, let me enjoy it while it lasts. Will and Jesse. They're just, so, oh, they're cute together, okay? I like it. And I just like Will vibing with someone <laughs> in that way. And Jesse seems cool. I'm happy. I'm happy right now. <laughs> let me, let me be happy. My date with Will went so well. It's just so, like, easy with him. I could have honestly just sat there and spoken to him all day. It was generally, like, a really nice date. <laughs> <laughs> They're both so cute. Oh, I'm glad they both think it went well. I think well as a third party who has nothing to do with it at all. <laughs> I just they're, cute. they're very cute together. I've I've spoken so much this episode about how cute they are together. <laughs> they are. I'm I'm enjoying them. I hope it continues to blossom into something lovely. That is gonna be it for today. Oh God, Love Island. Oh God, what a dramatic thing you are. God, Olivia and Zara continue to go to war. Of course they do. Will's found someone, thank God. Ron, I've still got my eyes on you. I don't trust you. I don't fully trust you. But hey, that's it for today. I hope you have enjoyed. If you have, please do leave a like and subscribe for more. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below, as always, as well. And yeah, we'll be back to continue watching all the drama as it unfolds.
Until next time, I just want to say a very special thank you for watching.